Anyway, bad ideas out of the way. See? See? He's like us. He, he understands. I know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm just saying, nothing gets a job done more than one that's done without being fighting a whole Alas. ass battle head on. Mm -hmm. Prefer to do things from uh, behind enemy lines. Couldn't agree personally. more. Don't worry too much about my kin. That's all I'll say. No, I'm very worried. I like See, the Bofo guy. He's he's quite nice. The Robert? They're the least of my problems and at least the least my height. So I'm not too interested. The Robert. I think they're about you know, know if we stack if we stack two saying. of them together, it'd be the size of a regular person. You could put like a really big cloak yeah, over them. Some halflings. of them are much wider than him. Oh my god. It that. makes sense. They're half a man, so you know, ah. Yes, 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 yes. Mind-boggling, isn't it? it? Things have reasons. Oh. It's like four of them. They'll be like, Hello, sir, I'd like to buy you know, an you ale. Know, you know your fractions? I'm impressed. Mm. And you know what they say. Basic math is you know, not too hard. Especially if you do a lot of... know how to read, so... Actually, I know well, how to read very basic sentences math now. Math is a good start. Thanks to Mirandel. You should take up merchant work. You would learn math very quickly. Otherwise you get swindled. <clears throat> I did know a few merchants, actually. I can grind. You know merchants, but do you do merchant work? Mm -hmm. No, I just kind of hung out around them while they did theirs. <sighs> also, I don't know if you both know, there's a big dried blood stain on the other side of the bridge. Ian Dale yes. didn't really fill them in on what happened. It's Byron Gamble's blood. Who's Byron have you, Gamble? Have you read? Have, have you read the thing? I read that. Yes, but who the hell is Byron Justice Gamble? Do they really care? Well, yes, he did. He was known as. Tag. Hmm. I was just stuck with the name. It looks the same. What does it matter if his name is the same? Well, apparently people were looking oh, for him. That's what I said. He was wanted. Now he's he dead. Yes. Shame. Yes. I told him my Big loud sound. And then he, you know, blood on the ground. <coughs> Wait, did you say you have a secret to meditation? I told him my secret to meditation, and now it? he's dead. It's your secret. What a shame. It's very long. It requires a great long conversation. I am curious. I time for this. He doesn't like my message. Sure Very well. Yes, you know. Besides, you'd be a very troubled child for me to tell you my my methods, I which Derek absolutely was. Child, you're not a very troubled child. Me. I am a very troubled child. Wait, wait. It's a drow. No He's idea. troubled. Now we're all hoodlums. Ah, yes. I'm still cooler. He did do it first. Yes, yes and true. with more stylish armor. Yes. That is true. He looks so trustworthy. Well, I have to go get my armor from... I have to go get my armor from inside. I'm not going to wear it all the time. Why, why would you wear your armor at leather. all times? Because why take it off? You never know who's going to try to kill you. I, you know, I figured, you know, standing in the middle of the sunlight, you know, on this wonderfully well, those beautiful things can winter's attack during day, sunlight. So that uh... those demons. But, you know, if they attack, you know, I'm going to go the other direction. I would hope so. I prefer not to go out during daylight anyway. Oh, they attack at night too. Yes. Well, good. But they also don't see me at night. You would think that, but yes, they can but smell probably. you. You know what? He, he, he does look quite I don't similar smell. to them. No, they see you as well, apparently, too. I was on the other side of the palisade on a hill. They were on another hill, very far away from me, and they threw a javelin at me, nearly hit me. So they can see in the dark as well as I can it. by the looks of it. I tried, but it was... They may see you in the line of sight, but if you can remain out of the line of sight, it will do you better. <clears throat> It's cold! Jumpin' boys! No. <laughs> <laughs> you set off his reflexes. His dwarven reflexes. His fight or flight. I, I'm still quick for me age. Actually, I'm not even that old. 
His beard doesn't even touch the ground yet. Yeah. So neither, well, neither does um, um Nicholas. Morgrim's oh, and Morgrim. Nicholas. Yeah, so Nicholas's like beard should be longer, shouldn't it? I feel like it should be. Probably he's the old one around ago. here. But he's really He's the long beard. Well, why is it? But his so beard short? isn't long, right? Yes. Well, maybe he did something disrespectful and they cut his beard as punishment. Is that what they do? Oh, is that what happens? Possibly. Uh, I don't know. I thought you just work. cut the heads off, because that's what happened here. Hmm. Do I look like I'm at knee height? I don't know anything about dwarves. Hmm. He's you also know, very I tried thin. going in Von Frolda once, one of the holds there, and they, you know, found my way in, and then they threw me promptly out. An elf Is making their way in? possible to be a dwarf dwarf? Uh, a was, dwarf dwarf? You know, I just wanted to, that would I be the quartling to that we talked a about A double before. dwarf. A double dwarf. You know, I, I thought it was dwarf. a great idea, Kyla. You know, I you know, had gone like this, and you know, I had a big cloak on, and sh shuffled my way in. Uh, I think it was your elegance that gave but you, you know, away. But you know, it wasn't good enough. Yeah, possibly. Mm -hmm. so, you know, I thought it was the best idea, because, you know, it's about the same height. I mean, if I stand, like, from directly behind you, kind of look, like, dwarfy. Yes, yeah, see? See? But, uh, somehow they found me out. I'll, I'll do it one of these days. One of these days. You'll you see. need facial hair. Facial hair is the only way to dissuade them. Mm. Mm hmm. You know, if I don't if think you can like, really grow visually. I don't think I, I, I've never had to shave, so... Hmm. I have, many times. I like to imagine there's a very big beard. I'd actually be surprised underneath if there. you had a lower face. <laughs> do you even have a jaw under Possibly. There? Is it just bone? I do. And it stammers. No, if it were, you'd hear... Instead of me talking. Meh, <laughs> <laughs> he man. I guess. What? Who? He man. He's a man. Who? Are you speaking? He's a man. Yes. He's a man. Yes, indeed. Yes. A, a Ew, man, indeed. men. Ugh, disgusting. Am I right? Pfft. God, Relax, races other than me. Relax. <laughs> imagine, imagine only living like 30, 40 years. <laughs> uh, scrubs. You know why we live 30 or 40 years? Because we don't like prim and proper lives. We prefer to kill things all the time. Hey, me too, but I'm gonna live and curiosity. X amount of years that I don't know. It's like a, it's like the gamble. I'll live forever in your head. Oh my god, he's right. In your soul. Oh. Oh. My soul. You know what? I'm gonna promptly forget about him when he's gone. I'm gonna try really hard to forget Good. about him. Really, really hard. If you if you forget me, then you have lost nothing, and you've gained nothing. Not my problem. But then if we remember him, we still lose nothing and gain nothing. Indeed. No, we gain his memory. What did I contribute to your life? He's trying to, show he's you trying my, to play mind games. In the sheath tomorrow morning, that's what you'll contribute. And I'll, I'll look at it every morning and go, someone made that for me. I can't remember who. Who made this? Yeah, who who made this? Made this? How did I get this? I don't even remember who made these for me. <laughs> hmm. Well, it was me. <gasps> it was you all along. You it was a stream puller. Indeed, puppets. I'm just entirely made of leather underneath these garbs. I made myself. Well, isn't <laughs> you isn't leather so just the skin of animals? So, like, could you <clears> make <throat> people leather? Is that a thing? Um, it's not nearly as easy, but I'm sure it could be done. I want a human cloak. Not it. Hmm. I don't think they would go over well with the humans. Really? Arn's too old. Maybe right. you should try the captain. I could make the cowl out of his, out of his nose. That's true. Give me a whole boot. It's not like the full boot. No, it's like the hood. It'll, it'll be the hood yeah. to his cow, you know, to, to his entire outfit. Well, one nostril maybe, but the other nostril will make a good boot. Give me a pair of boots out of his nostrils. That yeah, is true. I'll let him know you said that. Anyway, I'm going to watch the militia fall over in the snow. <clears throat> I bid you adieu. Don't go into 
getting into trouble. You're not my mom. Oh, really? No. No, still Kyla. Damn. I really hoped, yeah, just for one moment. My mother live long enough to get grey hair, so you're <clears> kind of out of, out of left field there. Neither did mine, it's okay. They're that training with turning. swords now? Yeah. Yes, they're training with swords. You know, it would be nice to actually learn a bit more how to use this thing, but I don't want to train with these fools. <clears throat> I'm, There's obligations. Uh, I'm an expert at swords, I think. Oh my god, you're right. <clears throat> I'll cut someone else's face off and wear it over my face so they'll think I'm human. Ooh. Slippery. <laughs> Hello, fellow bandits. It's me. Uh, Jeremy. Snow is slick. You almost slip off. Oh, almost. Did you catch yourself? Look! Ah, mother! Mm. Oh, it's right in the tailbone. <sighs> Fuck. And it's cold. Ah, it's cold in my ass. Wait, did Kat give me a wave? Uh, I, I, um, when I'm doing the overhead block, for some reason... Oh, I man, sometimes I just... The other side. Is there any way to... <clears throat> you know? ...that you have to stop me from doing that? Or is it okay to do flat hand against it? I know. Flat hand mm. is always best if you're going to do something like that, but if you're wanting to get out... Why of is the top bit of the yogurt always so gross? You're just going to have to keep practicing. Okay. Thank you, sir. You have to mix it. It's in a fucking plastic, like bladder. Is your hand glued to the blazer, Eric? I don't know. My, I, whenever I want to block, I keep going like this by accident. But he said I could still do flat hand. But I want to try and stop doing that. So I'm gonna try and put my hand behind my back. <laughs> Don't fucking handicap yourself on purpose. Oh no, no, he was just talking to me about uh, breaking the habit of putting my hand up. <coughs> so, it, it, like, it, like, if you catch like this, I can put him to do this. But, uh, it's a great way to fucking shut your hand. Yeah, and that's why I'm trying to break the habit, so I'm gonna try and put my hand behind my back. <laughs> Sergeant. You hit me. You hit me. No. No, I didn't. No, I'm ridiculous. Can I give you permission to fuck him up next time? 
Mm. Trying to get my foot attention. I don't know if he can ever see me. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Is he streaming? Yeah. Tell him to come over to me. If he's not busy. I don't think he looks at chat too much when he streams, though. Throw a snowball at cat. All right. Okay. Okay. <sighs> I on the ball. <laughs> Best two of three. Eight, nine, and seventeen. <clears throat> What's that mean? <laughs> nice. That was close to the last time, at least. Did I not hit it? I'm Did assuming I that you? was you. No. I <clears throat> was next to my feet. I don't know what you're talking you're about. Very close. Well, <clears throat> I'm assuming the only person around who would likely throw a snowball at me would be you. No. Just because I'm a drow. Oh no, not you sitting, <clears throat> sulking up on top of the wall. It's called brooding. Like some kind of loner. All right, brooding, yes. Don't prance backwards and forwards and lecture me, Katrina. I will prance if I want to, because I have a wooden sword. It's more than what I, I have. How to, <clears throat> I learned how to... Do you not have a sword? Not a wooden one. What happened to your sword? Well, it's in the house. Oh. 
Oh, okay. But you had one. That's okay. All right. Fair enough. I didn't mean to distract you from your training. Just wanted to let you know to watch your back, because people will, you know. That <clears> is <throat> actually good to know. Thank you. I. Mhm. Mm Bandits will throw snowballs at you. Yep. <laughs> right. I'm sure. <clears throat> I think it'd be filled with rocks. Uh, that's against the rules, weapon. I think. Well, then you're uh, just throwing rocks. How would so. you know? <laughs> I don't know. I just think, like, if you oh, were to right. get in a snowball fight with someone, putting rocks in there would just be like... <laughs> right. <clears throat> okay. Well, understandable. I, uh... I will make sure to watch out for, uh, snowballs. Very good. From bandits. All right. Continue your training, you. young. Yeah. Lesson, young lesson learned. One thingy. <laughs> right. <clears throat> okay, fair enough. <clears throat> Hello. What is fair enough? Um, nothing. I was gonna do something, but it was missed. It's all good. I see. You are steaming. Are you warm? That is how I usually am, yes. I'm so fucking cold. <clears throat> well, if you feel the need to, you can use me as a temporary source of heat. <sighs> we could cuddle? I don't know what cuddling is. We just kind of like hug for extended periods of time. As long as you ask first. Okay. Yeah, we can do that. I will respect your wishes. Every shot against you is gonna be a leg shot. You seem to be more bundled up than most other people. <clears throat> I'm fucking freezing. <laughs> like I have never seen snow before, and this is all very new to me. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Why does that feel so pleasant? What the fuck? <laughs> Thank you. You've been walking in the snow. <clears throat> oh. By my understanding, normal boots usually aren't as warm as winter ones. Mm. <clears throat> I suppose like all all young boys dream of like swinging a sword at one point, right? Well, as you can see, I'm already not very smart. Look at you there, man. Standing around. What? Unless somebody swanks at this side of you. One day, I will lend you the sword. You seem to be doing pretty well. We can if we want. Well, it's fair. It's, it's better than spears. The spears were atrocious. I did not like them. Mm -hmm. But swords are kind of just like bigger daggers, and so I I feel like it's relatively applicable. It's just you're holding it a different way. And I mean, it's not entirely. The footwork is the same, similarly. Uh huh. So it's uh. I didn't volunteer. I know I'm stalking, it's not as annoying as spears, I'm telling you. Just, you don't like just... They're annoying, I don't like them. No, they're just big and bulky and... They're taller than me and it feels like I'm Most wielding this giant you, thing that I... Okay, that's fair. But you're not that much taller than me, so you can't really... We measured. Much. I'm like a good... Something taller than you. <laughs> right. And you also wear heels all the time, so that's bullshit. Chat, roll a d20. Go on. Fair enough. I, 
Shut up. <laughs> you think I wear heels? Yeah. You just realize that. We did. Must be annoying. Didn't you take it off me when you tried to heal me up that one time? It was very annoying when I. Ah, don't remind me. I haven't touched anyone uh, in terms of <coughs> medicine wise since that because <coughs> I don't want to fuck it up. I think you did a pretty good job on me. Oh! I did a terrible job. <laughs> you alright? I nearly just slipped You're off. Fell. Yeah. Woo! Yeah, that was Woo. really. Oh my god. <clears throat> that would have fucking sucked. Why not be the best idea to walk on there? Oh, okay. I guess that's right. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. <sighs> right. Oof. Okay. <sighs> what are you doing for the rest of the day? Yes. Okay. Um, well, let's see. Let me check my calendar. My usual schedule is normally packed to the brim, but today I have nothing. Oh. Nothing. <clears throat> Loser. Absolutely nothing. Oh, I'm, I'm assuming you have something? No. I need to make some money somehow. That's right. Yes, because service is, uh, is gone to Adwick, so you don't have your little buddy. Do with anything. I don't know, you always look together. <clears throat> no, she barely hangs out. Follow around all the time. Really? I still see you two together. Uh, we all the time. exist together, but it's not like we're. Mm. Hanging out, I suppose. Is it because you're just the same race? Guess. Have to be together. Is that the thing? Well, I feel I like draw to her. I don't know. It's weird. Hmm. It is strange. Hmm. <laughs> well, anyways, I don't have anything going on, so uh, well, nothing of interest I can give you. No fun little quest or whatnot. <clears throat> need money. Anyways. I'm gonna go. Uh, you need. You said you need money. Why do you need money? What just, do you need money for? Well, I'm in debt to people and I need to pay for things. <clears throat> right. Let's see. How can we make you money? Well, their offer is still available. You did uh, working at the tavern for things and stuff in the evenings. <laughs> huh? Did you talk about it yesterday? Or was it the day before? It may have been the day before. Oh, I thought we agreed that no one would want to pay for that service. Captain? <coughs> did you show up to training? I, I did, yes. I was, um... I was watching the entire time. I, was, I, was, I was training. I... Even afterwards. Right. right. Okay. Um. No, incorrect. You're pushing your whole body down to meet that strike. Okay. I was sort on your right. Yeah, it's been a while since I've Okay. Alright, you're gonna sort on my right. I will strike, you will block, and I will even do the overhead. Make sense? Okay. Yes. Point your sword more forward against mine. There you go. On the count of three. One, two, three, go. One more time, a little faster, and this time I will do the overhead strike. Kang needs to learn how to use a sword. Head protected. Three. I mean, why wouldn't he? Well, because I've seen him just go like this. Into people. <laughs> yeah, but could you imagine him like, using his sword well, though, on top of that? See, I'd, I'd give him a big giant hammer. Yeah. Yes, I'd It'd give be him unstoppable. a big hammer. Big, heavy, heavy, heavy headed hammer, you know? Bigger than one Morgrim has, and just. <sighs> he'd literally destroy everything. For fuck's sake, his hands are bad enough as it is. Keep it up. Yes, but you imagine him with a hammer. Keep your blade up. No, I think I'm good. I think or, his hands or, are this, this was my this was my idea. <clears throat> Two big shields. And he just pushes everyone back. Okay. 
Yeah, how about you go suggest that to him and see what he thinks? Oh, I already did. You just need the steel for it. Yep. Yeah, nice this steel rim around the shield. The Bold's in the middle. Well, that's coming out of your pocket. Hope you have fun with that. Well, we already have four billets of steel. Could yeah, so who owns that? Iron? I could make it a... We, we do. We, we do, not you. Oh. I, I do. No, you could, went there. You went there. Could I get uh -huh. some of it? It's expensive. How much? Well, it's going to be... You'd have to talk to Morgrim. I think it's like a couple of silver for one piece. Can you? <clears throat> Fuck. I need money. Damn it. Yes. I was doing so well, then those fucking bandits rolled up and took everything. <laughs> Literally everything. Unfortunately. Oh yes, bandits. Mm -hmm. Took my sword, took my money, took my dagger, took my... other things. Your other things? Hmm. My special other things. Oh, isn't that what the guard and the militia are for? To make sure they don't take your things? Yes! Right. Stays where it is and moves over. Perfect! There we are, you even pivoted. Did you just mod how a hobbit? That does work. You know everything you need to know. I'm gonna give you a final exam, see what he thinks. I'm an old man, sir. It's kind of the captain. Keep it up, you know what you're doing? Yes. What's that? It's fucking cold. I'm just cupping my hands on my face to keep it warm because I'm fucking. <coughs> see if I can catch you off guard. I'll strike you a block. I'll start on your right. On the count of three. One, two, three. No, I've never felt you that warm before in my entire life. Have you uh read the notifications on the board lately? I haven't had someone read them out to me in a couple of days. Um, I think I've had a few Looks people like talk about changed. them. <laughs> oh, come on. All right. I think I know which is which. If someone could read them. Um, I might be able to help. All right. Oh. It's fucking freezing. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, yeah, you fucker. Well, you asked for it. No, I did, I did. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, you proved yourself. I showed you up. Just didn't want you to think maybe look like him, sir. Am I? You can do what you do, Arthur. Ah. Can I borrow that? These people are lucky. Of course. Hey, Taylor. Here. Oh, my leg. Who knows? Oh. Yes, even you may be the fucking one. I'd rather die of old age. There we are. Oh dear. It's not all bad, you know. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. I think my legs are given up on me. Cat and Marn. I don't know, sound good. Funny. Perhaps you should see yourself to the restroom. I believe I have lost. <laughs> Send yourself to the restroom. We'll be fine. Yes. Yes, yes you might I want will. to use the restroom. Fucking <clears> hard. <throat> <laughs> Sorry. I wasn't paying attention to the lesson, so, uh. <sighs> But I guess that helps. I can tell. Well, I wasn't a militia. Sword up. 90 degree angle. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I'm... <laughs> Point it between I don't know who that is. Right between. No, I've, got, I've got someone <clears throat> new for you. <laughs> Three points. <I'm... laughs> tell them to try. I'm not beating Steve-O up. <clears throat> Steve-O! Uh, who? who is this? Who is this? <laughs> now it makes <laughs> sense! I can't do that. Look him in the eyes and tell him... <laughs> if I kick him the way I just kick you, I'll kill him. You let Maya in! Really Baylor! Maybe. 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 I don't want <clears throat> anymore. Please no, really show really this know. nice I individual so what tired. you learned today. I don't want to get Um, I borrowed Maya's sword, no, so she's gonna need one. Uh, we'll put you up against your... 
Look at how me. big he is. He could pick me up and oh. stab me half the time. Well, no, because I was like, hey, I want to borrow your sword so I could like learn some things with Alan. Oh, I see. Always on your opponent. Never the blade, whatever weapon they have. Never look at it. They'll circle around trying to get you to look at it. They'll faint, they'll move. Your muscle memory will betray you. It will block something that's not coming. Look at your kid. Wait, that's why some people had ribbons on the bottom of their swords. In Gradia. Oh. I thought it was just a show. Just the ass. Okay. There you go. All it takes is a fraction of a second to make a mistake to look somewhere you shouldn't. That's why, even though some of it's annoying, some plate mail you'll see, there'll be glistening spots that are really polished. It's to glare your eyes to take you off the weapon. Hmm. <clears throat> so, point it right at the bridge of the nose between their eyes. But swordsmanship, there are six directions someone will attack you from. Six basic directions. They will be either side of your shoulders, either side of your gut, and either side of your legs. Does that make sense? That's what this was, right? Yes. So when you're blocking, take your sword, <coughs> block left, block right, block left, block right, block left, block right. Defensive the easy diddy for that is right shoulder, left shoulder, right gut, left gut, right leg, left leg. <clears throat> it's in reverse for me, but I see what you mean. However, you need to remember the diddy. <clears throat> diddy. It's the gist of what you're saying. Mm -hmm. And then when it's from the overhead, sword up, flat of the, flat of the blade pronounced, I'd say so. Support the blade with your open hand palm. I can't lift my arm that high. <clears throat> yes. I usually have something yeah, in this hand. You need to get gloves. Mm. Fine. Use the cross guard even better. Have a dagger in your hand. Use the cross guard of your dagger to hold the blade. There you are. Oh my god. Okay. And then you can slide it right off. And keep it there. Right? Let's say, using that imaginary knife, <clears throat> my sword is now here. Yeah. Right? If you were to pull your sword out, I'm going to clink down on your handguard, and you'll be able to hold my sword there. I would have to try and come around to strike at you. I'm already open. Look at your sword. Perhaps <clears throat> I fucking stabbed me. That hurt. <laughs> sorry. It's, it's just wood. Mindly just slid a wooden sword right I'm sorry. It just—it was chest. muscle memory, Art. It just kind of happened. I'm sorry. <laughs> what do you do? Just shank people when they're defenseless? Well. I'm defenseless. It was a joke, I didn't you? You just did it again. Oh, fuck! You stabbed me. <laughs> well, you said you weren't defenseless. You weren't defenseless. I just told you an overhead and you let me <clears throat> bop you on the head. <laughs> Good. Right. Eyes on the opponent, never the weapon, or whatever distractions they have on their armor or their blade. Alright, I'm going to be starting from your right, this side. Mm. Ready? Mm -hmm. Right shoulder, left shoulder, right gut, left gut, right, gut. right leg, left leg. That's the legs. Oh! <clears throat> Faster. Alright, let's do it again, muscle memory. Right shoulder, left shoulder, right torso, left torso, right leg, left leg, overhead. Good, again, <coughs> Right shoulder, left shoulder, right gut, left gut, right leg, left leg, overhead. Good, again, faster. Put more force into it. Ready? Right shoulder, left shoulder, right gut, left gut, right leg, left leg, overhead. Good. I'm getting Again. sloppier. Faster. Okay. Maintain your posture. Eyes on me, don't take it off. Ready? I'm not calling it out anymore. No, you're good. Yeah, much like that. Well, you did Obviously, you don't have to. That'll be the one up card that you have against your enemy. <laughs> <Then again. laughs> Good. Excellent. Oh, you move fast. 
One last time. Right. Fast as you can. Okay. Eyes on your opponent. I keep seeing you look up the blade. Don't look at the blade. Ready? Just make the movements. I said Perfect. Just like that. What the fuck? Eyes never off your opponent. Right. Very good. It's just about him. Practice that. Waiting for them to get to the door. Right. Oh, yes. I'm in agreement with them. Had some troubling and of course, you'll have your dagger. <coughs> so you can incorporate that however you see fit. I suppose we should make sure that you understand how somebody's going to attack you with a sword. Mm. Ah, thrust guard. Yes. What about a thrust? Do you have some. Oh, so. That's only somebody thrusts at you. Right. Go and thrust towards me. I'll step back, parry thrust. Guide the blade away. So for you to dispose from this area, please. <clears throat> now. Thank you, Understood, quick. Captain. Put your thank you, Captain. We will Close. continue You're training another back. time. Oh, thank you. Linda. <clears throat> Come on. Another time, time. Get back to work. I see you have lost control <laughs> of my legs. <laughs> what the fuck? Captain sort of dispersed out of the training areas now. Captain. Alright, let's go. Were well, you able to get some water from the tavern? No one's there. Oh, really? It's completely off. Hmm. I don't believe I don't fucking know. Oh, it was the knocking. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh, the one with the really oh, weird like voice. No! If you give me a few seconds, I'll be. If I have a dog like this. <laughs> So Kyle is just, like, his entire life that he has been fighting, he's just been kind of feeling it out as he does, so it's very sloppy. But he has a lot of muscle memory that he just doesn't understand the principles behind it. So Arn's connecting the dots for him.
if you could now, thank you. Just, just stay on. I just, just, stay on just keep on the download. Okay. I, I can't get into the download. Remember what I said? Be safe. I told you this morning. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> oh. I was much lotion. <laughs> I thought those things were always supposed to come out at night. Owl inside, you know? Well, they do. Yeah. 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 I'm sure you have. I, apparently, uh... Oh, that would be a good idea. I'm at the 7th and a half. The what? The 7th and a half. Yes. If not, then those hooded figures. Let's go with that for now. Oh, God, what is that lad doing? Hmm. Well, what are the rumors you speak of other than that? There's been a couple of sighted just now recently outside in the forest collecting hmm. animals. Deer. I'm just listening. They were talking about dangerous things in the night. So I wanted to hear. Don't just stand there on a corner. Come and join the conversation. Are we fighting? We're friendly. No, don't be sorry. Don't worry about it. That would be smart, but they also have to eat themselves, do they not? What if I do? What if I'm gonna die tomorrow? Who do I haunt? I'm in middle of the uh, uh, I'll come back to it that one. There's I'm a few. There's a few that I would have on the list. I, I think we're thinking of the same person. <laughs> Probably better than what you get here. It's a bit colder. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on the cold. Uh, piece of shit, but I'm on. Yeah. Pardon me, but you're doing the same thing again, baby. Uh, I'm doing it again. You're doing oh, it again. Fix yourself. Come for you're alright. You need to. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. <sighs>
Sorry, I do apologize. Oh, oh, Clara. Hello, Clara. <clears throat> Evening. Do you need something, Clara? No, I was just coming up to see how things were. Well, I've been having massive headaches, but aside from that, everything is fine. Did we ever end up uh, catching who was doing the? Breaking and entering. Ah, yeah. oh, yes, I, do, I did notice that you no longer have your uh, royal attaché with you. Hey. I fortunately was able to gather enough evidence to show that I was not the one breaking into my own scribery. So, hmm. I got that going for me. Which is nice. Quiet day. This. Apparently. Hmm. Uh, I think I wanted to talk to you about Jack. And Kyla, you can tell no one of this. <clears throat> Advisor Fulgrith has me gathering up a group to go east to the border. Apparently, things have gotten quiet over there. Troublingly so. He wants, you know, those things. We don't know. We don't know if it's simply... Who am I kidding? I'm sure you don't need to guess why this is troublesome, hearing no word from the border. <coughs> um, like from our people, or are they just saying that nothing's right. happening? There has been no word, whether it is quiet or otherwise, at the border. To that end, Fulgrith wants me to get a, a small group, even just one individual, trusted individual, to scout it out for me. Scout it out for him. Unfortunately, it is very much a fool's errand, and the likelihood of capture and torture and questioning is very high. So, unless it's a seasoned... party, which we do not have, then the likelihood of failure is very high. That said, it has to be done, because if we don't know what's going on, we can't plan accordingly. Uh, don't they have, the like, actual scouts marketing. for this, though? They do. Oh, they just send them. Kyla, there are no scouts returning from the east. So they send villagers instead to die? <clears throat> if your best yes. scouts, all of your contacts, went quiet all of a sudden, and you were in a dying keep, trying to hold things together, and you did not have resources to spare, what would you do? Assume the worst. Hunker down. So, why do you think we have lion horn? Someone is able to get some kind of information without benefit for anybody. If trained soldiers aren't returning, <clears throat> how long of a trip is it to the border? I don't know. Can't be that far. We are fairly close to it. Essentially, this is a mission to see how many days or hours we have before the worst.
Well, obviously my skill set is suited to this. Yes, however, you are a drow. <clears throat> that is true. And Funny how they go, go hand in hand. If you go and you are captured, they will do worse than torture you. I'm aware. Usually the case. I've been told humans only. It's mission. Very well. Not happening. So it would make sense for a drow to move in the night. It would. We wouldn't even have to risk being spotted if we just sit back at night time and just see. Take it slow. That is true. And even still, and what you said daytime. is true. This is a suicide mission. This is a one-way trip. Unless somebody would probably do it. What's the elevate. point then? I suppose, yeah. Carry a raven. Write it, send it back. Hope to god it doesn't get shot down. Who would you take? There aren't many humans in Ledford. That is strangely quite true. To be honest, Arn does know the path to the southern part of the Can't ask this of Arn, Berendil. Has given more than anyone. Yes. Has also volunteered himself. However, I do not know if I will take him. I'll send him further. I was going to send a courier, as he has done business in the east, and it is not odd for a courier to travel between us, since we are at peace. Technically. <clears throat> but he's not here. So. And Seraveth would need to go with and him. I have not yet... No, she would not be going. She would say fuck you and go either way. Let's talk to her. In either case... It explains why they're both in Adwick right now. She must have somehow convinced him to leave, since I, she knew that. I would be sending him. And what are our options? We never have good options, though. That is true. Though the only man that does know the way into the Empire that we had access to is currently... No longer with us. What, are you talking about Cade? to identify him first. Doesn't matter. <sighs> so it's either we wait for wait for Kate to come back, possibly send him on a death sentence. That would defeat the purpose of the trip. They do have to come back. And uh, I could try and send a raven out with them to send them word back, but then that well, assumes that they... Do we know when Cade's coming back? Because <laughs> if he comes back in a couple of days, then we are losing days of knowing what's happening over there. Ignore me, I'm having problems. Right. Give me a moment to look at some of my paperwork. As much as I would rather send Cade than Arn... We can't wait for him to come back. It's 
It's not like we can just send a detachment guard with us. They'd see that as a fucking opportunity to pillage all of us. Well, they'd see that full stop as well. <clears throat> My, hello. Did you kill someone? Oh, animals. Wait. Oh, no. Oh, right, the dwarves. Okay, I get it. <laughs> Poor dwarves. Well, we're going to set up a. I don't know. Either way, I'm sending someone to the devs, most likely. It shouldn't be on us, Mirandel. Don't exactly have a choice. But yeah, we could say no. <clears throat> if trained soldiers aren't coming back, what's the point of sending untrained peasants? I have a suspicion. I don't know why. Go on. I think Fulgrith is trying to test me. <laughs> right, so you pass the test by sending see... someone else to die. Yes. <laughs> Isn't that kind of immoral? <laughs> immoral? Have you met the man? What is it? What if he's trying to test your resolve? Why not some send him somebody? Maybe you'll pass this test or whatever it is. Mirren's already he's gone against to his orders too many out. too many times. He knows of Mirren's resolve and he's broken it. Did you just say, Kyla? He knows of your resolve. He's tested it enough. And what was that last part he said? You just said. And he's broken it. Do you really believe that? Are you really believing you're about to send someone to their death just to prove something to him? Is that something you're actually considering? <clears throat> you were told it was a suicide mission. What do you gain from passing this test, Mirandel, if it is a test? And what does he gain by knowing that you will send someone to die for him? Obviously, your resolve is not completely shattered because you're dealing with this and you're trying to comprehend it and figure some way out of it. It's not an easy position, I understand that. Just don't know what to do. And I feel like if we send someone there, and they send a raven back, or they come back alive, in the off chance that they don't die, we're just confirming what we're already knowing. Right? Does it not seem like a pointless task to you? I don't know where they are. Well, east is a good bet. And if we don't know where they are, how do we know that we're sending the people to even see them? Could be just sending them out into the fucking wasteland. Figure out where they are by figuring out where they sent their scouts and when they meant went missing. Where that happened, you can assume that that's where they are. Scouts just don't go missing for no reason. Outposts don't go quiet for no fucking reason. Come on. While that is true, assumptions get you killed. <clears throat> Especially when you do not know where your enemy is placed. Right, which is why he sends the scouts. And then they don't return. And if the scouts don't return, it's 
it's obvious that something either got rid of them or they are so far behind enemy lines they can't they have no chance of coming back they shouldn't be behind enemy lines they should be in our lines looking and seeing where they are if it was such a simple Fine. thing as just going there checking on what's going on and then coming back they would have been here probably days ago exactly <clears throat> It's a test, Mirandel, but I understand you need to prove that, but at the risk of someone else's life. Earlier, you mentioned Arn knows the way to stuff. What did you mean by that? Has he been there? Was he like Tarek? Is he from there? He's an old man. He's traveled. It doesn't matter, though. <clears throat> I'll refuse his request. You know that could easily mean your head. Or at the very least, ask for more information. I'm in. The door unlocked. Let me get it for you. Oh yeah, every time my starts up with me, I'm like, ah, this is gonna get like, <laughs> it's actually gonna get my blood riled up because she does it so well. It's great. <laughs> like, one of the few NPCs that isn't afraid to straight up be racist, and I love it. <clears throat> Balls to the wall. <clears throat> when I come back, minus another ear. I'll let you know. <laughs> what can I do for you? You're being strong-armed into this? I don't know if he wants me to talk about it in front of office, but they'll find out eventually. You can helped go. him fill this out. He wanted you to know that. Be on guard or? I didn't ask if I yeah, could. Yeah, be on guard. Yeah, with a chick yeah. on it, but. Lads, I need you back. inside the gate and I need you to close it behind me. I'm moving. What the fuck? What's happening? Tyler, with me. We What's need happening? to get the mirror down. <sighs> Whoops. Uh. Sneaky little bastards. What the fuck is that? If you're in, you're in. Oh, fuck. Okay. What the fuck happened? <clears throat> Was that Godfrey? He's alive. How is he alive? What? Mirandel. What? Godfrey's alive. What? He just entered the town. They just closed the port colors. Huh? I did not know he was thought dead. Wait. He came back. 
Where is he? He's outside. We can't get out. They cut the park color. Godfrey? Oh, what? Yes. For what reason do they consider him a threat? I suggest you care. step back, please. Get this fucking gate open. Uh, my lord, pleasure to see you here. What brings you back to Ledford? Words with your lord. That's words of our lord. Why is this gate sealed? Captain Rallis orders. That's why it's sealed. As we step back, I feel like there might be blood coming. <clears throat> Surely no. Rallis orders. I'm just following him. I do not care who is in charge. It would be very wise to tell your lord to open this gate. Well, you might have an audience here soon, my lord. Godfrey? What? <coughs> Lord Abbas, you speak to me through a closed gate. I do. Last that I heard, there is treason afoot. Thus I must take treason. all precaution. Yes. <laughs> and who told you this? Your spider? The one that crawls My around and spider. spins his little webs and lies? Huh? My advisor? Is the one that has spoken this to me. Your advice. Evidence. Yes. Evidence. I'd like to hear this evidence, my lord. It is not for me to state. Because there is no fucking evidence. I'm on the main what? road with the rest of my army and the entirety of your father's army, along with King Aelis himself. It would be very, very wise of you to open this gate, my lord. King, King. Open the gate, I, Captain. Uh, Wait, um, open, the open the gate! Open the gate! Gates! Gates! Make way! Fucking get down. Get back on yes, the walls. Uh, I, I, I I one of you in that. Shall I be present for them? Come on, lad. Don't be shy. No, no need to scribe. scribe. Go about your business, scribe. What's that? We don't order. We don't order. They look like a bunch of fucking idiots just standing out there. Where do I find that? Stand firm, soldiers. Don't let their tongues. Looks like a disaster has to come in. No, until the Lord tells us to. Several hundred soldiers from Go Godfrey. More than that. Godfrey's men. He came marching in. Mm -hmm. More of them on the main road too, apparently. God, even more. Mm -hmm. I counted two hundred at least. Few. No, Captain. The rest of them on the, the king. Yeah, it's captain. Mm -hmm. Good seeing you, Captain. The king? Yes. Yeah, so you're still around? Mm -hmm. Hey, push. The king. Lot you Apparently. Busy. Busy. Ah. Uh, <laughs> 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 it's fucking cold. Protecting our lord. <sighs> Hope the weather's been treating you well. It's cold. It's fucking cold in those suits. I can't as long as we keep moving, we'll be fine. It's cold, but at least. Hey, I'll just think you as Martin. Fucking mad. I mean, you don't even got I leave you to it, then, lads. <laughs> Why don't you come on in while the Lord is doing his business? Right, it's pretty yeah, nice standing out here in the cold, eh? Yeah, All right, you be nice. Come on. Kinda. 
case warm. I'm freezing. Please. Is your house open? I, I can open it. Can we go in there? It might be more private. You remember Dunstead, right? The, they said the king was dead. And now Godfrey is back. Not dead, perhaps. Uh, you, you think that, you know, he would have been attacked or something. Apparently he was going to be, I think. But Godfrey is alive. And he's marching back, back here with hundreds of troops. And also, so, mind you, only saying that there are more troops with the king on the main road. Do you think Godfrey's actually just going by himself if the king's dead he's just using the king's name and <sighs> well he said lord gavis's father <clears throat> is with him i.e our king and king aelus wait lord gavis's father lord gavis's father is gradius king what Erland's king Ar Ar wait Lord Gav oh, sorry, I was thinking, uh, God, the names, the names, they're yes, so confusing and them. long. I was thinking Fulgrith. Yes, yes, Lord. Yeah, yes, the prince, the prince. I just call him the prince because it's easier because the prince is the son of the king. Right, right. Okay, yes. so. They're saying it's his father, but I don't understand. In, in Dunstead, they were saying that the king might have been dead. I had reason to believe he was dead. <clears throat> So what happened to him? And why is he now alive? And apparently with hundreds of soldiers marching with Godfrey. Missing is he going you. to hmm? disrupt his own son's castle? I don't... Could he not just talk to his son? I don't know. What's going on? I'm so confused. So the king isn't dead. We confirm that? No, we can't confirm and deny that. God, that's really annoying. I don't know. Anyways, I just wanted to ask you that because uh, clearly... You're the only other person who went with us, I think. Right, it was... You. I don't know, something like that. But basically, yes. There's... One, two. Yeah, I'm just checking Asked something. to know if you knew anything else. I just need right. to check something. Because I want to make sure I got this right. Mm-hmm. Oh. Okay, never mind. What? Okay, yes. I, I was confused. Yes, very confused. Yep. <clears throat> I thought he, uh... I thought he said, Your father... And... King Aelus. Um... Mm. And for some reason, in my dumb, stupid fucking brain, I thought King Aelus was the... King of the Empire. But no. No, 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 no. That's someone no, no, different. No, no, no. That's king why I was Elizabeth confused. Is... <laughs> no. He is king the Elizabeth king. King is definitely the king. Yeah, yes. I, I do know that King Elizabeth is the king. Uh, yes, right. Oh, God. Uh, yeah, no, because the, the Empire, he doesn't have, like, it doesn't have, like, a king. It has, like, an emperor, I think. Uh, emperor something I don't... <clears throat> I wouldn't know. <clears throat> right. I would assume if it's an empire, then they have an emperor, right? That's that's what I was assuming. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It's so but, weird. Um, it's not like that in Gradia. What is it like in Gradia? There was a king, and he was overthrown. His whole house was completely overthrown by four large merchant houses, uh, families basically, four and they kind of so. kind of share the uh, the responsibility, I Hello, suppose. Okay. They're like a council, essentially. Okay. Yeah. Oh, a council. Yeah. Do they, like, cut the crown in half and each, like, wear a part of it? I don't think there is a crown anymore. I think they abolished it. They were like, fuck this, this guy doesn't know what we're doing. And, um, since then, Grady has been, or Gradio, has been very, uh, lucrative in terms of trade. I'm sure you know that they're, like, the How only people that... we do something that... like that? Fuck. Well, we're not a coastal, uh, <laughs> continent, are we? Well, a coastal, uh, kingdom. Well, why can't we at least... I don't know, have a council? You want to kill the king? Why does it have to be a king? <laughs> oh, 
do I want to kill could the tell, I don't think I could tell I do, Godfrey. actually. Please don't tell Godfrey. Please, for I, the love of God, don't kill Godfrey. I considered killing the king. I could not kill the king. Do you actually consider you, it? But... Uh, no, it was like a. It was one of those things where, like, for a split second, your mind is like, "Oh," and then you're like, "Wait, what?" No. That's where you and you Sarah know? differ, I suppose. What do you mean? Oh, well, she's like, "Kill the king? I could probably do that." God. Very confident. Not that stupid. <laughs> oh God. Confidence and stupidity. Okay, okay I am. Right. Ah, uh, I didn't mean to say that she was stupid. Ah, uh, but yeah, no, it, it was just. Uh, sorry. Ah, uh, wow, I completely called her stupid, didn't I? Um, you totally did. <laughs> I am offended on her behalf. Ah, <laughs> uh, sorry. Ah, uh, yeah, right. Um. Anyways, I'm. I'm not. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway. I am learning to write, but I am, in turn, finding that my English is slowly decreasing in uh, ability. You've reached the maximum load your brain can handle. It's starting to push out abilities yeah, and it, information. It, it, that's exactly <clears> what's It's a way to remember the names. I just, like, dumped... Yeah, I just dumped everything that was in my mind out onto the floor. And now I've, there's just nothing left in my mind. It's just empty. Because I just I just spoke a bunch, and then I was just like, Pino! and then they just vomited on the floor, and now I'm just like, Wait, uh, 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 and there's just this mess of a polit political bullshit that I'm trying to look at and confusingly figure out, and it doesn't make any sense. Okay. I'm just going to have to get them up. We went to, Ledf uh, we went to Dunstead with a missive from Godfrey to Lord yeah. Commander Merrigan. The missive that we had said he believed Forgreth was a traitor to the throne and that he recommends Merrigan send his troops and surround them to protect Lord Gavis. Right. Merrigan believed that the other houses might see this as a way of aggression. So he was hesitant. Mm. On top of that, there was another missive that arrived just before ours. Right. From supposedly Fulgrith. However, I think... Mirren said it wasn't. That's what I was thinking. I believe it's from someone else. Yes. That said... And who was it from? I be Possibly um, the person who delivered it. The... What's his name? The person who delivered it. The, the, the royal... The courier. Royal courier. courier. No one royal else would have... Courier. Well, no one else would have given... An, those iron rules the order to kill us because no one else was with them except for him but who sent the message if it wasn't the royal if, if it wasn't the prince was it the king the, the, the no because it came from ledford and that courier has shown up a few times in ledford working on Fulgur's behalf he's also been putting some uh, letters around, well, notes to people, keeping an eye, to tell some of the guards to keep an eye on certain people. Really? Hmm. How did you, how, how did the fuck did you find this out? Don't worry about it. Holy shit, alright, well, Totally uh... wasn't luck, full school. So, <laughs> the missive that he sent, Fulgrith supposedly, but not Fulgrith, um, Suspected Godfrey of treason. Um, something to walk in on. Oh, right. Mm, comfortable in my bed, are you? So, I was so, sorry, sorry, sorry. We were just discussing the scenery of <clears throat> the town currently. Kylo, if you're gonna do that type of thing, not my bed, please. Thank it was, you. Uh, no, we were talking about. No, I would have. I was going to drag the carpet over to the Shit. fire. That was my plan. Fair enough, the carpet is soft. There's a spare blanket in one of the crates if you need to. Oh, I don't we, believe we, she built. She... We were talking about politics. What do you need to say, Mirandel? Okay. <sighs> From what it sounds like, we are talking, going to talk about the same thing, so I'll just go out and write and say it. 
Godfrey has been accused of treason, accused of trying to kidnap or kill Lord Gavis, and now they are in the Felder's room meeting. Why am I not surprised? Said that he had King Aelis with him, and then that immediately made Gavis open the gates. But if King Aelis was here, why has he not presented himself? I Said they were on the main right. road. With his army. Mm -hmm. Why would King Aelis leave his army with what we know is in the woods? Why would he send Lord Godfrey? Considering all of the rumors, surely news has reached him. Why would Perhaps not. King Aelis have Fulgrith here as an advisor? Given so, so Godfrey did. Him? He did actually. He, he came here marching with uh, several hundred troops and trying to essentially attack whatever the, the prince or Fogrith or whoever and he na used the king's name and in, in a meeting whatever armies Cat. no did he not he showed up he today the, the king was in the he said the king was in the main road mm -hmm. and waiting the main main the road that, i assume their army is very large and wouldn't make it into ledford that would cause a fucking there? ruckus we don't know i thought he just said I the king wasn't there so. oh you're saying why would the king leave the army sorry sorry okay stay quiet now just about me i was trying to catch her up on everything but the new guys showed up that's when yes. you i'm a little long <laughs> <coughs> yeah sorry i'll try not to wander into my own house again apologies no by all means Continue. Yeah, Sorry. that was the case. The fuck? We're not gonna do anything about it. Mm hmm. <sighs> yes, let me rally my army, Mirando. Give me Good, five minutes. Good, thank you. That's what I was waiting for. Appreciate that. <laughs> <sighs> five minutes. I can do about it, Arn. I just. Just wanted to come in and have a good old hen gossip. 